In the NBA, there are good teams, the teams that make the playoffs, and there are bad teams, the teams that don't make the playoffs. And in this scenario, we're going to help out the bad teams. Because the 14 teams that aren't in the playoffs as of this day, March 19th, 2017, at 4 o'clock p.m., we're going to add one NBA legend to their roster. And we're going to see if adding that one NBA legend will help them get to the playoffs and maybe actually win the NBA championship. So once again, the bad teams that were decided were the teams that aren't in the playoffs as of March 19th, 2017, 14 teams. So let's check out these 14 teams roster and see what legends they have added. Philadelphia 76ers added Allen Iverson, 94 overall. Chicago Bulls, surprisingly out of the playoffs, but now they have Michael Jordan. Charlotte Hornets, Alonzo Mourning. Sacramento Kings, Oscar Robertson. New York Knicks, Patrick Ewing. Los Angeles Lakers, Kobe Bryant. They could have added lots of other legends, but if you watch my other video on adding NBA legends, you'll know why I added Kobe Bryant. Magic Shaquille O'Neal, but if, by the way, if you haven't checked out my other video, what if every NBA team added an NBA legend, be sure to check that out because that will explain how I picked these legends and why I picked these legends. So be sure to check that video out. Link will probably be in the description or it's probably in your suggested, just click on it before you continue this video. But yeah, back to the rosters. Mavericks, Detlef Schrempf, Nets, Vince Carter, Pelicans, Larry Johnson, Pistons, Isaiah Thomas, Suns, Steve Nash, Timberwolves, Kevin Garnett, Trailblazers, Scottie Pippen, and that's it. Those are all the teams that are in the playoffs as of this moment. And by the way, we're starting from the beginning of the season because you can't start the NBA today with a custom roster. I wanted to do that. I wanted to start the NBA from today, but you can't do it with a custom roster, so that, that sucks. But just know these 14 teams are in the playoffs right now, and they're going to get some help. And the team I'm going to root for the most in this scenario is going to be my Trailblazers. I'm a Thunder fan, but I'm also a Trailblazers fan. My top three favorite teams are Thunder, Wizards, and Trailblazers. So go Trailblazers. Going to simulate through date. We've reached the end of the season. LeBron always wins the MVP award. Nothing else is new. It's usually him or Russell Westbrook. This is all the same. All NBA first team. No NBA legend spotted. All NBA second team. You got Kobe Bryant and Michael Jordan and Shaquille O'Neal making the cut. All NBA third team. No NBA legends. All defensive first team. Michael Jordan, Kevin Garnett. All defensive second team. No NBA legends. But let's check out if these non-playoff teams made the playoffs this season so the 76ers did make the playoffs the chicago bulls did make the playoffs finished second actually what a big improvement hornets did not make the playoffs the kings did not make the playoffs with oscar robertson they still finished with the worst record in the nba well close to the worst record i thought oscar robertson would help them the Knicks did make the playoffs with Patrick Ewing. The Lakers missed the playoffs with Kobe Bryant. The Magic did make the playoffs. Wow, and they're one of the worst teams as of right now. So Shaquille O'Neal did help them big. The Mavericks missed the playoffs with that lift shrimp. The Nets, yep, still the worst team in the NBA with Vince Carter added. Pelicans missed the playoffs with Larry Johnson. Pistons make the playoffs with Isaiah Thomas and the Suns still pretty bad even with Steve Nash. Timberwolves did make it with Kevin Garnett and the Trailblazers big improvement finished second with Scottie Pippen. So now that we know which teams made the playoffs and which didn't let's check out the scoring real quick for these NBA legends Allen Iverson 26 points Michael Jordan only 24 Lonzo Mourning not scoring that much. Oscar Robertson did not average triple-double like he did back in the 70s or the 60s. 
Knicks with Patrick Ewing only 19 points. Kobe Bryant carrying this Lakers squad still couldn't make the playoffs. Orlando Magic, Shaq, of course, carrying, doing his thing. 23 points, 12 boards. Maverick, Stella Shrimp is probably one of the worst legends I've added. Vince Carter, only 18 points. Larry Johnson, 17 points. Isaiah Thomas, 19 points, 9 assists. Steve Nash, only 14 points. And 8 assists. TJ Warren outscored him. Kevin Garnett, only 12 points. 13 boards, though, with 2.4 blocks. Decent numbers. And the Trailblazers, Scotty Pippen. All around game. And now here we are in the playoffs with the playoff bracket. So, seven of the 14 teams that added legends made the playoffs. And seven didn't. So, not every legend helps the team, but big improvement. Seven non playoff teams actually made the playoffs. And in the first round, my Portland Trailblazers are facing the Memphis Grizzlies. And we got two matchups with NBA legends. Patrick Ewing and the Knicks facing Shaquille O'Neal and the Magic. That should be a good matchup. And we got Allen Iverson facing off against Chicago and Michael Jordan. So simulate current round. Let's see what goes down. My Portland Trailblazers did beat the Memphis Grizzlies in five. The Knicks with Patrick Ewing beat Shaquille O'Neal's Magic. Isaiah Thomas's Pistons beat the Raptors. Allen Iverson's 76ers beat Michael Jordan's Chicago Bulls. And Kevin Garnett's Minnesota Timberwolves got swept by the Spurs. So now my Trailblazers are facing the Spurs. And we got Isaiah Thomas versus Allen Iverson. And Patrick Ewing against the Cavaliers. Simulate current round. All three NBA legend teams got eliminated. There's only one team left that added an NBA legend. And who would have guessed the Detroit Pistons with Isaiah Thomas? Can Isaiah Thomas make it to the NBA Finals? Let's find out. Nope, they lose in five games to the Cavaliers. So the rest of this scenario doesn't even matter. And the Cavs win the NBA Championship, LeBron Finals MVP. The Spurs actually made the NBA Finals. I've never seen them make the Finals in a scenario before. 2K usually hates the Spurs. But hey, we did improve seven of the 14 teams. And four of those seven teams advanced in the playoffs. And one of those four teams made it to their conference finals. But zero teams made it to the NBA finals. And zero teams won the NBA championship. But there was improvement being shown. Now I just want to see what each NBA legend averaged in the playoffs. Allen Iverson 24, Michael Jordan 27, but losing to Allen Iverson. Carmelo Anthony leading the team. Patrick Ewing was the third leading scorer. Did average a double double though. Shaquille O'Neal carrying this team, but losing to the Knicks. Andre Drummond. This is an insane stat line, actually. 24 points, 17 rebounds, 2 blocks in the playoffs. That's why they made it to the Eastern Conference Finals. Isaiah Thomas and Andre Drummond stepped up. Minnesota Timberwolves, Kevin Garnett not scoring. He almost averaged as much rebounds as he did. Actually, he almost averaged a triple-double. 10.7 points, 10.2 rebounds, 6.5 assists. And the Portland Trailblazers losing to the Spurs. Scottie Pippen averaging 16 points, 6.5 rebounds, and 8 assists with 2.6 steals and about a block. You already know he's an all-around player. But that's going to do it for this video. We did improve 7 non-playoff NBA teams and made them reach the playoffs. And some of them actually advanced in the playoffs. One of them made the Eastern Conference Finals. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And with that being said, I am out.